Here at KZRV, we focus on the details so you don't have to. And no one does it better than KZ's Plant 4. That's where our entire Connect line is manufactured, from our brand new Minis to our SEs and standard Connects, as well as our Sportsman Classics. Now, a lot of love goes into every unit so that when you pick up your trailer, you can be sure it's the best unit money can buy. Here at KZ's Plant 4, we're building our units better from the ground up, starting with our tires. We use Goodyear Endurance tires, the same tires I have in my car at home, are on every single Connect standard from the factory. On top of that, we're using the BAL NXG frame, assembled right down the road in Elkhart over at Norco Industries. They use a steel that's about 30% stronger than your typical alloy steel, the same material found in trucks, bridges, buildings, all sorts of high stress environments. On top of that, we're running PEX color-coded plumbing through the floors that we assemble right here in house. So we can build them the right way using 5 8 inch tongue and groove plywood. I'm standing now where your slide out box is going to go to show you a couple things about our lamination process. First, Casey is laminating all of our sidewalls right here on site over in our lamination facility. When they're done, they're brought over to the factory and first the slide out box is going to be cut out. Now here at KZ, each piece of fiberglass is marked to go right back into the wall it came from. I know that sounds like a no brainer, but it is not an industry standard. Some factories will use any piece of fiberglass that fits. Additionally, we're using Asdale paneling in our sidewalls as opposed to your Luon. That's gonna be about 50% lighter than the Luon and it'll be much less likely to delaminate over time and it's gonna be impervious to your water damage, mildew, that sort of thing. Additionally, our aluminum framing is going to be stuffed with wood. That gives the screws a whole lot more to bite into and gives you a much sturdier wall for a lot longer. Something I like to point out that KZ does a little different than other manufacturers is how we insulate our front caps. We've got horizontal framing here and you'll see sometimes other manufacturers are using vertical framing and what can happen is over time the insulation will slide down in the front cap and allow for some more cold air to pass through up top. You don't want that because when that front cap goes on here, there's really no way to adjust that insulation. Because we do such a great job with everything else, we like to assemble our roofs right here on the factory floor as well. We're using hardwood trusses 16 inches on center. Additionally, we've already framed the holes for your air conditioner and your vent skylight. That way you're not cutting any additional holes into the roof. They're already framed for you. After the roof is fully assembled, it's lifted up with our in-facility cranes here, placed on top of the unit and installed there. After which we're able to start rolling out the wiring and rolling out the batten insulation. After we've finished wiring everything in the roof, including your prep for backup camera and laying all the insulation, we lay down 3 8 inch OSB, and then on top of that, we roll our one piece PVC Tough Flex membrane. That membrane has a lifetime warranty. And now your roof is fully walkable. So we install a ladder right there on the back so you can get up there. Something we do a little different here in Plant 4 are our front caps. Both the Connect and the Connect Mini come standard with a three quarter length fiberglass front cap and it is featured as an option with our Connect SEs. Now this front cap is painted with automotive grade paint and your windshield here is automotive strength glass. Here in KZ's Plant 4, we're using 3M graphics with each floor plan having its own template that the graphics are cut from and our experienced graphics team is placing all of these by hand so you can be assured that you'll always get the correct fit. Folks, I've said it before and I'll say it again. KZ puts a huge emphasis on our quality. That's why here in Plant 4, they have to update this banner each and every year. And something we do here that sets us apart from other manufacturers is, along with the inspection that each and every unit is going to get before it leaves the factory, we'll pull one unit randomly for a rigorous full day inspection. Now, if it manages to pass the 300 point inspection, 
the entire plant gets a 10% A raise for that week. Now, since we've started doing that, our warranty claims have gone down and quality and satisfaction has gone through the roof. That's why once you buy a KZRV, you're gonna only wanna buy KZRVs.